Krishna Hare Krishna Welcome to this episode of the Karting Inspirations. Today here in Vrindavan is the uh, Bahulastami, the appearance day of Srimati Radharani, where at 12 o'clock all the pilgrims, all the villagers, <laughs> all the people who have come to uh, celebrate Radharani from New Delhi will take their midnight bath in order to um, invoke the mercy of uh, Radhakund. Radhakund, as you must have heard, is the place where uh, all the Tirtas, all the sacred rivers, all the lakes mm, who contain the special potency have come. Mm, Srila Prabhupada wa once uh, remarked about Radhakund. The land in Radhakund is not expensive. You can make an ashram there. Then Prabhupada asked, looked around to his devotees and um, questioned them, What will you do there? The devotees answered, Preach. Listen to Prabhupada's response. No, Radhakund is not for preaching. Radhakund is for relishing. Again, Prabhupada paused. This is a good idea. When we come to places like Sri Dhammarada Kund, we should know that uh, even Krishna worships Radha Kund. At times when Krishna has not mm, the personal audience of Radharani because she has uh, turned into a sulky mood where she l lovingly rejects him. She doesn't really reject him. Her heart longs for him, but in order to teach Krishna a lesson, to be more careful with her, her gestures, her facial expressions, tells him, don't come close, he is Yam Sundar. Mm. So at this that moment, Krishna who knows that Radha Kund is identical with Srimati Radharani, will come there with flowers and with incense, and he will offer this worship to Radha Kund in order to obtain the mercy of Srimati Radharani. Radha Kund is for worshipping, for relishing, and when we are well nourished by this, then uh, we carry in our hearts a divinely inspired taste. A taste that everyone who comes in contact with us will feel. Mm. Preaching is very easy, said Prabhupada. Just show them how happy you are. <laughs> and that is only possible when you have relished and become nourished by Radharani's Kripa and by Krishna's Kripa and by Guru's Kripa and by Gauranga's Kripa. Radha Kund and other such very, very holy places are for filling our own batteries. Wishing you all the best and I know I have not talked about the six principles which uh, mean help us how to stay on the wave that will come in the next episode but Bahulastami or Krishna's arrangement uh, came in between our own plans and to stay on the wave of Braj means to respect, acknowledge and follow Krishna's uh, arrangements willingly see you for the next episode Yes, there's a small addition here. Uh, some say, uh, basing uh, their statements on 
Jiva Goswami's uh, writings in Gopal Shampu that uh, this is not the actual time of appearance of Radha Kund, but it is celebrated like this and devotees like to celebrate why not one time <laughs> sorry why not twice why only one time uh, yes uh, also uh, I wanted to say how can you practically worship Radha Kund today let me suggest to you a simple way as take a photo of Radha Kund. you can use even a digital photo and then sit in peace take uh, an incense or light and offer it mm, uh, to uh, Radha Kund and Radha Rani and simply connect in devotion with them and you will actually uh, feel you have been there and you have celebrated. You can also take a mental bath but uh, 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 these two first mentioned ways are immediately effective. I wish you a happy uh, 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 celebration of Shimati Radharani. Mm -hmm.